lads, what's going on Gonfia? And today I'm going to be bringing you a silver hybrid squad builder. Incredible, incredible overpowered team. Possibly one of the most overpowered teams you're going to see. It's just, it is ridiculous. It slams gold teams, it slams silver teams, it slams any team. It is such a good team. But hope you've all had an amazing New Year's. I know I did. New Year's Eve was just hectic. Got absolute out of it. Pretty sure the majority of you did as well. But Anyway, lads, we're going to get off to a bang. I'm going to be bringing more and more hybrid squad builders because I've been slacking lately. But to start this off, lads, we are going to be in goal with, I'm not sure how to say his name, Marcelo Boyk or Boyak. I'm not sure. Um, decent keeper, has his ups, has his downs. He's a little bit inconsistent. A lot of silver keepers are very inconsistent. One minute, he'll make you like a ridiculous save. Next minute, you know, they're, they're on their ass. They can't save a thing. He is six foot three and he's got pretty balanced stats for a silver keeper. So, decent for 3k. A centre back. Our first one is going to be one of my favourite silver centre backs, and he's going to be partnered with one of my other favourite silver centre backs. They're both just incredible. I mean, Manuel. I used this guy before. Manuel De Costa, six foot three. He's strong. He's quick. I mean, I know seventy pace doesn't look the quickest, but trust me, he gets around. Eighty head, and he doesn't miss a head. He's amazing in the box. Definitely worth the five k I paid for him. And next to him, he's going to be partnered with Zalao. Z um, Zalao or Zalao, one of them. Not sure. What This guy is possibly the best silver centre-back slash one of the best centre-backs on the game. He's up there with David Luiz. He is incredible. Love him to bits. He doesn't miss a challenge. He's so strong. He's quick. He's amazing in the box off corners. And he's just OP to fuck. Our left-back then is going to be this guy, lads. Another overpowered left-back. I mean, 88 pace. If you look at his card, you think 88 pace, that's all he's got. No, no. 88 pace makes up for every other stat on his card. So, it means he's amazing at defending. It means he's good in the air. It means he's got good dribbling. It means he can even shoot and score goals. It means he's got everything just because he's fast. It's pretty it's pretty fucked up by EA, but what a player. And I'm just loving this defense. Right back is going to be... <laughs> I, I mean, what EA, come on. What is that? What? You can't class that as a picture. That just looks like a black blob. I'm black myself, so don't take any race to it, lads. But I'm not being funny. That is bang out of order. I can't even see his hair. <laughs> Come on, but, I mean, he's an amazing player. 89 pay, 71. He, you have to pay quite a bit for this guy. I mean, 8K, I got him cheap. He's normally around about 10, 12K. Uh, 71 defended, 89 pace. He is just one of the most overpowered right backs. You're going to play with a lot my team. Trust me. He's amazing. Only let down is his picture. I mean, that's just pathetic. Uh, our first centre mid, though, lads, is going to be as one of one of the most overpowered centre mids on the game. I'm pretty sure a lot of you are up to date with this guy. He's a four-star skiller. He's a CDM originally, but I got him centre mid, and it's Jokalai. Oh, my sweet lord. This guy's incredible. You could play him in any team. He is just um, he's amazing. He's definitely worth the 50k I paid for him. He is currently price locked at around about that price. I think one day he'll come down. I'm not sure. He's very, very expensive, but trust me, lads, he's worth the coins. Our first centre mid then, well, our second centre mid, sorry, holding it down in the middle is going to be Cloudmere. Incredible little guy, I mean, only 5 foot 9, but in that midfield, he just bosses. He's got a good pass, I don't know what that 66 pass is saying, he's, he can pluck a pass. 65 shot, he's got the best free kick I've ever seen in my life. No joke, you'll see from the clips at the end, he just scores free kicks for fun. He's just, he's amazing, he feels so nice on the ball, and he's just overpowered to fuck. And our last centre mid then is going to be, to sum up the whole midfield, this guy, Paolo Ricardo M Machado, or Machado, I'm not sure, but he's got a four-star weak foot, a 78 pass, can pluck a pass, a dream. 74 pace, not the quickest, but decent for centre mid. He can defend as well, and for 7k, I mean, that's why you've got, you're going to be paying for these guys. Uh, we've got some defensive, and we've got some attacking centre mids, as you can see, lads. So the midfield is pretty balanced and pretty overpowered. But moving on. To our forwards, the first one is going to be Calvin. Oh my, probably my favourite player in this whole team. He is just, I love him. Me and Calvin go way back. We go back to the beginning of the game. When I first picked him up over over uh, Mike Onlier, over Danilio. I went for Calvin and he is just incredible. His price is dropping rapidly. I mean, the first time I had him, he was like 100k. He's coming right down now. He's a five-star skiller. Left footed on the right side and he's just a little genius, lads. You'll love him. Go out and get him. You will definitely love him. Then our left forward is going to be this guy. This is the first time I used him, Yassine El Gnassi, something like that. <laughs> and he's amazing. I'll definitely be using him again. He's just a complete and a goal scorer. He gets into the amazing positions at the right time. He just, he's so fun to play with. He's overpowered to fuck. I mean, he's a four-star skiller. You are going to have to pay around about the 10k mark for him because he's a premiership silver. And he's an amazing one as well. But... 
trust me, you will not go wrong. And by his nationality, I'm pretty sure you can work out who we got up front. It's going to be, sorry, there we go. The monster, the steam train, the absolute black horse, whatever you want to call him. It's Lukaku. I like to call him P Prince Luke. No, no, I don't like to call him. That's just a complete lie. I call him Lukaku. He's amazing. Six foot three, 90 odd strength. Four, four star weak foot. He's left footed as well. Some people like to have left footed players. And, and the worst thing about it is he's only 19. Trust me, this guy is evil. He will punish any defence. He, he, he reminds me of... He's like Ibrahimovic, but obviously not as good. But he's just incredible, lads. Definitely worth the coins. Score, he will score you goals, get in the right positions and bully defenders. But I, when I tell you to go and get this team, lads, please go and buy it if you've got the coins. It's going to cost you... It's, it's pretty expensive. Maybe around about the 300k mark. Maybe I'm not, I'm not 100% sure, but... It is definitely worth the, the money. I will leave how much it costs in the description. I'm babbling on a bit now. I'll leave you with some goals, lads. Hope you've enjoyed. Peace. Someday we'll decide where we want to live